In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how easy it can be to create a tank top, but still easy to ruin it if you avoid to add some details on it. So let's see if I can pull it out with details or not. First of all, let's imagine that you don't know anything about clothes 3D and how to draft a pattern. Don't panic. It's super easy. You don't need to know any pattern experience before and let's start with the fourth one from the up and we call it polygon with the polygon while you're holding your left click mouse and drag let it go and you can see the care it gives us I'm going to add another point here. If you think you cannot go completely straight, you can also hold shift. It helps you to do so. Another point. And another point. So right here, you can go with another point or you can add points and hold it to give you the curve that we are looking for and also this again hold the point hold it until it gives you the curve and let's close it exactly at the same point that we started double click and that's it so right here we can see that we need to adjust these points right here because this is so uh, sharp over here as soon as you click on the point you can see these arrows that you can simply adjust the curve probably a little bit okay now I'm happy with this draft. Let's go to click the first option over there, the selection, and then right click, go to the symmetry pattern with swing. It's here. Again, let's click on it right click and copy right click again mirror paste and again select right click symmetry pattern with swift so let's jump over here to the 3d window and in the avatar display we can go and choose the arrangement points what arrangement points does makes everything much much easier and in a place without any effort so click on the first one that you know it should go to the front and click choose one of the pattern for the back choose one of the points but make sure not to flip it okay make it right now you might think that okay this is much uh, lower than this one what we should do there is a very easy thing to fix just use the gizmo and now we want to go grab the swing segment you can either go with the swing segments over here or go to the 2d window and do it right there again okay one very important thing that you may do is that you have to be careful with the sewing section when it's crossing each other it's not right they should not be like this and it's gonna kind of twist the garments they all should have 
straight lines. So in regarding to fix this issue, let's go grab the edit slang tool, click on the edge that we did the wrong slang tool, and click on reverse slang. Now it's fixed. Let's go also to do it. Next one. And this one. Okay. This is what I meant for making it very easy. As much as if you leave it like this, it's not professional at all because you know every single tank top that we have in our drawers they don't have any swing lines in the middle and in the back we don't want this we want so let's go we can do two options first of all we can go select the edge and cl right click and hit merge like, like this or we can go with the swing, edit swing tool and over here on the property editor we can put the intensity to zero and delete the normal map so uh, still there is a swing line over there but we cannot see it in the render another thing we need to do we need to um, careful to fix the color so the front one should be much much lower than the back Okay, let's do something else. In case of um, we want to detail tank top, we need to click this edge and also this edge of color. Right click, offset as internal line, and let's set this. We want this to maybe 1.5. Okay. And now we want this to cut and sew. Why we did that? Because we want to give this extra thickness. So when we select the color, we come over here on the property editor, add thickness rendering, and let's add this to two centimeters. And here on the 3D window, we have to also uh, turn on the thick texture. Also, we want this thickness on the hem and on the armhole. Again, right click and offset as internal line. Okay. Cut and sew, cut and sew, and cut and sew. Let's select them all. Give them two centimeters. No, this is sorry. This was not centimeters. Two textures. Another thing we need to add is to add a segment top stitch in the full top stitch under property editor let's set the type to texture and set the offset to um, 3s916 and you can also change the color let's change the color to a little bit gray let's click the segment each segments we need that to be more professional we need to check that all the top stage 
in a good size or not we can change also the size over here usually i set this to 100 instead of 40 but it's completely up to you go to selection tool select all the patterns and then under property editor we want to set the particle distance to something like 10 again simulation and now let's go to see the render view this comes out from the render view you can see all the stitches all the hem and everything's coming out without any lines in the front this is also the back side of tank top there is no line in the middle but there is a line over here on the side and now we have a super professional tank top hope you like this video see you later next one